I think these entities like finance and procurement are slightly dodgy. And let me explain why I think they're dodgy. And I'd say the same as management consultants as well, to a great extent. What management consultants and finance and procurement are allowed to do in a business is take the credit for cost savings without ever being put in the frame for lost opportunities or missed opportunities. So you've created an asymmetric entity where you can claim the credit for money you've saved, but nobody ever accounts for the opportunities you miss as a consequence. And so if you give the finance department too much power, you grossly bias the activities of your business towards doing sensible things and doing less and less. And effectively, you turn your business in so that it's optimized around efficiency, not optimized around discovery. There's always a trade off between efficiency and discovery. And if you put the decision in the hand of the finance guy, he's biased because he can claim the credit for cost savings and never have to get blamed for, for missed opportunities because cost savings are immediate and quantifiable and go on the balance sheet. Missed opportunities are invisible.